eight yards on that play. And they start with Carmen. Here he goes. Across midfield. Showing those skills Todd just mentioned. An electrifying run to open the game of 39 yards. His vision and his ability to cut back quickly, stay low to the ground, and right out of the gate, he has his best run. He's had two weeks his long. J.J. McCarthy, the quarterback, running way downfield for a block at the end of that play. Here's Ronnie Bell. Down to the 21-yard line. Jim Harbaugh says he's not worried about it. Comes out firing, caught. Max Bredesen, the tight end. They've had a full week of preparation. Impressive opening drive. McCarthy dumps it off. Another first down. Colston Loveland, the true freshman. Luke Schoonmaker injured. He is dressed today, but limited. Corum showing some of that power at 5'8". And the tight end, Bredesen, lined up as a fullback in front of Blake Corum. On third down and goal, Corum! Touchdown, Michigan! An impressive opening drive. No looking ahead toward Ohio State and Columbus next weekend. Well, again, three tight ends, an extra offensive lineman, and a powerful runner. And the opening drive for Michigan goes perfectly according to script. That mothers derive so much joy from watching their sons do what they love to do. Quick pass out to Casey Washington. He's ripped down by DJ Turner. And he runs with the motion man, Bell. McNamara. Lots of running room for Corum. Blake Corum down the far sideline. And out of bounds across midfield. And another big play by Corum. Watch this tight end. He's going to get a block on the linebacker. And that's who's responsible for Corum on the screen. It's man coverage. And they can't get the defender out to cover the screen because of the block by the tight end, Loveland. But he has been very impressive on a great football team. C.J. Stokes, the true freshman. He's the backup running back today. And another big play. Xavier Scott, the true freshman. J.J. McCarthy seemed to surprise Ronnie sure Bell. Did. The ball caught him at the 46-yard line with Isaac Darkangelo there, their leading tackler. And Corum jams into the line. It looked like he got just enough. Third in the nation in time of possession this year. Illinois is sixth. They both like to run the ball a lot. Their defense is so good, they get off the field quickly. Scott just three catches all year. Deeper down the depth chart. Chase Brown. Weather was nice. Yeah. You were out there in a t-shirt. Long throw, DeVito, and that one's caught at the 49-yard line. Eight for 11, DeVito, 70% completion percentage coming into today. Sixth in the country. Here's a reverse. Isaiah Williams dynamic with the ball in his hands. And Illinois is on the move again. Last time they moved deep into Michigan territory. Williams was a former quarterback. He came here as a quarterback, switched to wide receiver. DeVito with a block. Also Julian Pearl, number 54, the left. But into that howling wind. From 29 yards, right down the middle. The second pass interference penalty he got last week was really a bad call. Here's Corum across midfield. They can't get him down and finally tackled from behind at the 39-yard line of Illinois. Freshman tight end Loveland. The motion takes that corner out of the way. So there's nobody on the perimeter because of the motion by Ronnie Bell. And the tight end Loveland with a nice block. Second of 20 plus today, 15th of 20 or more this season, leading the country. Beautiful throw. McCarthy on target to Ronnie Bell. Michigan on the move. They're at the Illinois 17-yard line. See, it's not man, so there's a hole between those two defenders, and McCarthy threatens. Only one miss under 40, as you saw. 
the last two seasons. This is from 46. He won the Lou Groves Award as the best kicker in America last year, and he's having another excellent season. Chase Brown breaks free and scores. Touchdown, Illinois. Watch the left guard and the left tackle. They come off together, and then the tackle releases to the next man. And you see Chase Brown running with power. Also, Sidney Brown, Chase Brown's brothers, another safety. They're both going to be day three picks as well. So three draft picks from this Illinois second. Right, Walter says he's the best corner he's ever been around. Here's Gash. He got hit hard out of bounds. Watch the tight end come in here and get a block on Sidney Brown. Sidney Brown is going to be responsible for the back, but he gets picked off. And because he gets picked off when you're running the screen, if your man is blocked, they have a good field position. Their own 37 to play fake DeVito and a catch. Second outstanding catch made by Casey Washington today. Chase Brown, good blocking again. Chase Brown on his way to the end zone. Touchdown, Illinois. The guard, Isaiah Adams, come over. Marquez, the tight end, pulls. And then watch the other tight end, Ryman, lead down the field. Kick out, lead through, and a lead blocker. And Chase Brown has freedom to the end zone. That's excellent execution on the gap scheme run, which is one of the bread and butter plays of this. After last season, but I think the line is better. They hit home runs in the transfer portal with a couple of starting guards. Ronnie Bell. Ronnie Bell across midfield. Big time return. I actually thought Ronnie Bell was signaling for a fair catch. And maybe just to get balance. He makes the first couple guys miss and then picks up some blocks along the Illinois sideline. Big time return. I think he was just kind of yep. balancing himself and preparing for the catch. And it is good. Just barely inside the left upright. He's had a great year coming over from Garden City Community College in Kansas. J.J. McCarthy with eight minutes to go. Has Colston Loveland chopped down in Illinois territory at the 42-yard line. 27-yard play. Somehow he got lost. It was underneath zone coverage, and nobody ran with the tight end. And a nice... One more time and kick another to win it. Moody makes it a one-point game. He's good from 33. And three for three today. They don't have a timeout. No, they're going to throw it. And it is deflected by Seth Coleman. Wow. I mean, if that gets picked off on the interception. I'm not even sure what they were trying to accomplish with that. He was throwing it to Cornelius Johnson. With 12 seconds to go, it is good! Good snap, good hold, perfect kick. And his 65th career made field goal, number one now all time in Michigan. The record setter, his biggest. Michigan's gonna rush only three. Defenders spread out all over. DeVito does throw it high in the air. It's going to come down near the 20. Incomplete. And now it is over. Michigan goes to 11-0. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.